So just the other day, I got a comment from one of my YouTube subscribers, and I kind of had to stop and think about it for a second because it was such a basic question, and I actually never really thought about it because I thought, you know what, the whole purpose of this channel was to explain things that other people didn't know. And then I realized that there's a lot of things that people don't know that are what I consider the most basic questions ever. Now, I had just recently done a review on an HP 24-inch all-in-one computer, and this user asked me, how do I open the CD drive? Now, to me, it seemed very simple, but if you've never seen one of these before or you've never owned an all-in-one, it could be a little confusing. So I took a minute and I said, you know what? This is the kind of stuff that people want to know. We're going to get into it. So Tasha, thanks so much for your question, and let me show you what you need to know. There are three ways to open any CD or DVD drive. There is the button that usually is somewhere on or directly around the drive. There is a very tiny pinhole, which you can use a paper clip to stick in and force the drive to eject. That really comes in handy if you have a stuck CD or DVD in there and you need it out. Just push the paper clip in until you feel it resist, and then boom, pops right back out for you. So Tasha, first thing is this is the back of that particular all-in-one machine. So I also took a smaller picture of it for you and circled it so you can see. It's actually on the back of the drive, and you might not actually feel it if you reach around the back, but if you find the pinhole emergency eject button, it's directly below that. And I've got a circle here on the screen so you can easily see. So Tasha, I hope that answers your question. If you have any other questions, please feel free to reach out to me. And just remember, push button on the drive, the emergency eject button, or you can actually go into your computer, right click on the CD or DVD drive, just choose eject, and it will pop right open for you. Thanks so much for your comment. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. So if you enjoy content like this, I'm making a whole playlist of back to basic stuff that you might enjoy. Check it out.